Today, we're honored to welcome a distinguished panel of former International House residents who will help to illustrate the many ways that IUPUI prepares students to operate in our globalized world. When I come to our house, I think I'm probably close-minded a little bit, and I think taking time to understand other people and really uh, enjoy being friends with other culture and how similar and how different we are. I think all everybody enjoy good food. <laughs> so we always, you know, go to somebody's uh, room and hey, what are you cooking? And it's really one of the highlights as well. So there was always this camaraderie with, with I have residents, whether that was getting groceries together, whether that was going camping together, whether that was making pasta together. So that was really incredible. Yeah. <laughs> one of the things that I thought uh, uh, Will did very well with the international house is actually have Americans in there. Okay, because <laughs> we did that. <laughs> so, are you sure? Are, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> I think one of the main things I came to learn after meeting iHouse was how much I learned to include people and not exclude people. Make your life, again, more open, but make sure that something as simple as Invite them to dinner. Well, let's go try this international restaurant. I've never been there. It's making sure you are open to your friends from all over the world and know that you're there. When I would come here to the U.S., I, this is really my dream to be here. So I was like, I'm going to study hard. I'm going to get a job here. Really, other things is like secondary. I think the one thing that I missed out is that really taking the time to know people and build friendship. I think that's to me, I, I miss that. I could have expanded my network and have more, get more uh, people to know. So I think it's really important to really, people around you that you see every day, say hello to them or really try to understand because sometimes you, you may find your new friends. So we could never have uh, enough friends. So I think that's that's lesson learned for me. I think there's two things. One is the people connection with sense of uh, diversity inclusion always in mind. And second is to always reflect the values you, you are holding, no matter what nationality and what culture you're from. Um, with that uh, value in mind, it will help you to focus what you believe in and what you can really grow yourself. Being able to live in I house in hindsight, it was really helping each other uh, sort of like navigate this new terrain, new environment. So in, in high, you know, like you're saying, when you're in school, you're kind of trying to focus on what you came to do, especially as an international student. Um, and you tend to not really socialize enough. Um, and especially if you know you're going to go back home, you're thinking, well, why do I need to make friends? Um, but it is it is important. And, and like you, I think I, I kind of, missed out on some other great friendships as well. I think, uh, you know, make memories. I, I think uh, a lot of the things, things we couldn't share on this panel. <laughs> um, oh, our fondest, fondest memories. <laughs> um, it's just the memories that we, the, the times that we spent with each other, um, uh, the troubles we got into um, <laughs> together. But um, just, Share memories, you know. Uh, I don't know if you have an American in your in your apartment, you know, go camping, uh, make pasta or make whatever it is. Um, share share memories and it's, it's the one thing that you're gonna be you will you might never remember the hours you spent at the library or you will never really remember uh, other sacrifices that you, you had to 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 make. But the things that you probably most can remember is the memories that you shared. So create memories more than anything. Well, I just want to thank all of you for being here today. I think what you had to share was very helpful for the audience. For me, um, it, it's wonderful to hear these stories about how iHouse through the years has impacted you and is still impacting you. So thank you. Thanks. Thanks.